right, so here we go with round one. And on one side, clearly the more well-rounded fighter. Yet when we sat down with him on Thursday, first words out of his mouth, he ain't going to submit me. I'm going to try to take him down. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> and you laugh just like that because you know how much of a joke this is. You want to avoid the grappling with this guy at all costs. I know he has bravado. I know he has a big ego, but it would benefit him to fight this fight and make it as easy as possible. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Watch knees to the body. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. Can't take too many more of those. Wow. Oliveira's head kick attempt, that one is blocked. <laughs> Trying to double up on that jab. Liver kick. Beautiful strike. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Oh! Huge kick to the head. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Misses again with a right punch. Two minutes now to go in round one. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. So just over 20 total strikes have already landed for Charles Oliveira. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He is a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. And he landed the right hand there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Seconds here in round one. Round two winding down. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. Doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Oliveira's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh, yeah, right hand. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Oh, and he gets tagged. Beautiful combination. Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, he might be out. Lee gets tattooed by that straight punch. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Oh, misses with the jab. Nice 
Nice job striking here by Charles Dubronx Oliveira. Outstanding UFC resume, and the striking is really starting to catch up with the grappling. Scary proposition, really, for any man in multiple divisions. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have a novel idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of these. He's got to try to check it, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kick, he'll just pop a jab up, get the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is so diverse yeah. and has such a great understanding of landing these leg kicks. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, Whoa! just a brutal kick. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Yep. <laughs> so a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here and as a result has really picked up the pace in round two. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Throws the right hand there. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Try to establish that jab. Ten seconds now to go in the round. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went head hunting, landed, Nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this round. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Right on the button. Real nice body kick land. And both guys really throwing with authority. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Just misses with the punch by Oliveira. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. What a fight we got going on here. Nice punch by Oliveira. Oh, he's landed a high number of totals. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Big kick. with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see him. Oh! oh! he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. 
Just out of range with that right hook. Nice punch there by Oliveira. Final seconds. There's no tell on that leg. Right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. You ready? You ready? Fight. Well, he hasn't really shown. Oh. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Ooh, what a punch. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oliveira's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Big knockout win for him here tonight.